This is a home generator I built a couple years ago. I've done some upgrades to it since its original inception. I used to have a push button start on it with a switch to turn the alternator's field on and off. I've since upgraded it to a complete key start. I have a six horsepower Briggs & Stratton vertical shaft electric start engine. A Delco CS144 series 140 amp OEM alternator. I have a Xantrex ProSign 1800 watt sine wave inverter and two 50 amp hour 12 volt batteries serving as backup for when the engine shuts down. On the front end we have the inverter's control panel and hospital grade GFCI outlets. I also have heavy duty Anderson power pole connector 12 volt connectors for charging external batteries and a 175 amp rated power pole connector for serving as a 12 volt start cart for cars with dead batteries. And now we're going to go ahead and start the generator. Prime the engine, a couple of pumps, put the keys in, turn it on, and start. Engine's cold, so I'll probably have to do it a couple times. And there we have it. Because the AC power is generated by the inverter, the engine can run at whatever speed it needs to keep the alternator charging the batteries and powering the inverter. It doesn't run at a consistent 3600 RPM. I can slow it down to idle under very light load. I haven't officially come up with a name for my gen set, but if anybody out there has any ideas, let me know. Okay, see ya.